Uh, it's pretty obvious what levels are specifically made for the Dark Prince and what's made for the, the, the Prince of Persia. But it just doesn't feel like... I just p would have preferred if you could just switch back and forth to the Dark Prince and the Prince. Utilizing both of their abilities. Which would probably have made it more interesting. And I can't really talk at the moment because I'm trying to survive. Okay, I'm trying to see where I'm going, but it's so foggy, it's a pain in the ass. You have been infected by the sands of time, as I am sure you have noticed. Maybe it's the dagger, maybe it's all the time you've spent amongst the sands, or <laughs> amongst the Empress. Either way, you are resisting it. Mostly. Mostly? You did just transform into something rather unique, so I think the word is quite appropriate. Think of it this way. You have been given a gift. You're stronger, faster. Now, now. That explains the transformation. That explains the transformation. But who are you? Have you not realized? I am your untapped potential, your unrealized dreams. I am part of you. Me? In other words, your conscience, you idiot. Yeah, the Dark Prince disappears when you hit water. Basically, the Dark Prince is basically a. Water seems to fight this corruption. Why did you hide this from me? What? And ruin all the fun? Yeah. So basically the Dark, the dark Prince, the voice, is basically like a, a conscience of him, or at least another part of his personality. But, what I find really disappointing about the Dark Prince, the physical one, is that the Prince actually is... When he turns into the Dark Prince, it's still the Prince, um controlling the body. I thought when I first saw the Dark Prince and the Prince as being as one body, I thought both personalities would have changed and taken over bodies. You know, that sort of scenario. And of course I thought you'd be able to switch between them, utilizing both of their skills in combat and platforming. But no, you're forced to turn into the Dark Prince whenever the, the game fucking says so. And for some reason I did not grab that. Why not? And oh shit! What am I thinking? Yeah, sorry there, folks. I'm just uh, making no sense. Ah, these bastards again. Oh yeah, every time you turn to the Dark Prince, your secondary weapon is gone because, you, you know, you've got the chain now. So I mean, it's just like to disappear, I don't know why. Jesus! Will you just die? I really hate these lizard men. For some reason they're so fucking tough. Die! Oh, for fuck's sake! Will you die? Die like Samus, like Samus on fucking Metroid 
am her character. God. Just die, please. Oh, for God's sake. They like to block a lot more. It really is pissing me off. Die. Thank you. Dissolve, you complete utter bastard. Oh. Ha 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 ha. Break dance, you motherfucker. Well done. Quiet, you, Rick Miller. I would say, yeah, the, the Dark Prince is disappoint disappointment. And I think that really sums up the whole, the uh, sums up part of the game, you know, disappointment. Hey, man. There's two ways to go. The fuck? This is not supposed to be le- Ah, oh, wait a minute. This is supposed to be like the the Fountain of Youth sort of thing. But I don't know if I'm going the right way. That's the thing. Actually, no, I don't believe I am. So, hang on, let's go back and claim that because we want more health. Yeah, some reason that you've got this random yell uh um uh, fountain of youth thing. You don't go back to the actual thing back at the uh the Sultan's palace. It's kinda odd. Don't know how this is supposed to work. Oh wait man, maybe I was heading the right way. Yeah, well done there, Jammy. You were heading the right way. Damn, I don't. Um, once again, this is this is the game where I never found all the health um, upgrades, but maybe I should since this, since uh, these enemies seem to like to not doesn't seem to like to, like they take a lot of damage. Oh wait, they take massive amounts of damage. Ah, there it is. I was going the right way at first. What is that, a crown? Or a cup? Looks like a cup, actually. Oh, now you gotta do the challenge. Ho ho ho! That isn't good. Duck! Go, 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 go! go we must head towards the light of something. You gain a health bonus! Magically. Um, yeah. And I felt that kind of, I felt that was kind of half assed as well. Once again, it's kind of one of those things that's not really explained. I don't know. I don't think Babylon had some kind of protection to it. Because at least in Sands of Time, you would suspect that this, that, um, the place in uh, the Sultan's palace back at Santa Time was actually protected protected by a genie, and of course a genie is like another form of a devil. Therefore, they could be good or evil. Shall I continue my story from here if you are called away? Come on. And out of the sewer, we're in a random rock field place. Nice. <laughs> but I think that was more like a water channeling uh, place instead of a sewer. Because you never heard the prince. Oh, okay. You never heard the prince complain. Oh, the smell! Jesus Christ! And that's my Scottish part coming out. <laughs> Scottish accent. Jesus Christ. That smells like fucking shit. That's because it is shit. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Get him, get him, get him. Ugh, I'm just kind of... I'm kind of glad that they brought in the speed kill thing as well. Maybe... Just because it felt okay, that's really it. When it the doesn't prince really... was struck by the sands of time, something was woken within. Something strange and cunning. Something dark. The seven years spent on the run had embittered the prince and made him hard. This burden sustained his other half, gave it strength. The prince was tempted to do as it said, for it was a light in the darkness, offering comfort and guidance to a man who had just lost everything. But what were its intentions? Why did it help him? Only time would tell. Yes, well done, trapped for drawing out that voice. <laughs> Even though this voice still doesn't make much sense, you're dead. And who are you telling the story to? Okay. Oh shit, no. Oh, that was lucky. Oh, and it's bright. It's broad daylight so now. Away. As a child, father would tell me stories. Pay about attention. Something's happening down there. <laughs> the prince was monologuing himself, and the dog was like, "Shut up!" Oh no way! It was Rick Miller that said that. Rick Miller. Pay Rick Miller says, "Pay attention, that? prince." It's the vizier. He has been completely transformed. Interesting. He has used the power of the sands to transform his army. And these artifacts will allow him to transport them across the city with ease. He appears to be in complete control. Things do not look too good for you at the moment. Uh, why did he not came here? Let the vizier have Babylon, my city, my throne. So is Rick Miller going to give us more words of wisdom? A gate. We will follow him through it. Would you like to hear more? Sorry, I still don't feel the voices are loud enough in this. I know you keep saying, I want subtitles, but this game doesn't support subtitles for some odd reason. Don't ask me why. Actually, hold on, no, I don't want fucking controls. One sound. Let's just put that back up one. Okay, that'd be Allow fine now. Alright, this is save. Should I continue from here when you return? 